Section 7. Test Scaling In this section, you will learn to organize your code so that it could be scaled seamlessly and executed flawlessly in your Docker environment. You will create a grid setup yourself and will have complete control of the testing process. Also, you will walk through third-party tools and services. Selenium Grid In this video, we will have a look at Selenium Grid. Selenium Grid, as it, it is officially stated, is a smart proxy server that routes Selenium tests to test execution hosts. Its main objective is to provide a way to scale parallel test execution and allow test execution under different environments. Indeed, running 200 plus test scripts in parallel, even with some tricks to optimize test execution, is not exactly rapid application development and short feedback loop especially if you have to do it again and again for different environment configurations. All this can be done faster just by utilizing more computing power in a more efficient manner. Right after its release alongside Selenium WebDriver, Grid has proven to be an indispensable tool for test automation engineers. Grid consists of two types of hosts, Hub and Nodes. Hub is what represents the server part of Selenium Grid. It's router application that relays Selenium WebDriver instructions to nodes. Nodes, as you already understand, are the client applications that perform actual WebDriver JSON wire instructions passed on to them by the hub in the host they're being run in. Hub stores a list of configurations available on all of the nodes that are connected to it. Configurations represent browser types, number of sessions, and platforms, amongst other things. Each node can host several simultaneous sessions of different browsers. What you have to be aware of is that this is a very resource-intensive setup and requires capable hardware to support it. Now that we have introduction to Grid, 